uh, A, which is um, showing you how to select areas of a black and white photo and add color tints. Okay, now the main thing about this worksheet is it teaches you how to select parts of a picture. So, as we saw in the demo, um, the introduction demo, we can zoom in on areas. So, we're going to have a little look at the lion. So, we pretty much want to fill the screen with the lion. That's what we want to do. Now, we're going to have to select um, the lion to add colour. Okay, so there's different ways of selecting. The first one, if we look at this toolbar now on the left hand side, halfway down, if we click and hold, we have three different types of lasso tool. The first one we can forget because you can't really use it with a mouse. So the next two, polygonal lasso tool, magnetic lasso tool, and these allow you to draw shapes on your picture to do effects on. So we want to draw around the lion. Now I'm going to use the polygonal lasso tool for mine. So I'm going to click on that. Now, every time we pick a tool on the left, we have settings along the top. The first setting to look at is feather. Well, we'll set it to about two or, th two or three to start with, unless I tell you otherwise. It just gives you a nice soft selection. And then it's like dot to dot. So you click, move, click, move, click, move, like that. Try not to double click or you'll accidentally close your selection off. I've missed his tail out there, but it's all right. So ever the bit you were working on, I'm rushing this for the sake of the demo, you can be a bit neater than that. Okay, so I've selected the line. Next thing then, I need to change the colour. Okay, the way to change a colour, you go to Image, Adjustments, Hue Saturation. And you need to, because it's a black and white photo, you need to click on a box that says Colorize, which will add colour. Okay, and we want, we'll turn the saturation up. And now... We can add a kind of liony colour and turn that colour up or down. Okay, when you've finished with an area, you click on select and deselect. Okay, so that's added some colour. Let's say we wanted his eyes to be blue. We use this tool here again, the zoom tool. I'm just going to zoom in on his eye. Use the lasso tool again. Image adjustments, hue saturation again. Image adjustments, hue saturation. Colorize. And I'm going to change the color to blue. Because we have that color in any, any color we wanted. Again, select, deselect. Okay, that's another way of adding some tinted color onto a black and white photo.